Welcome to part two of solving radical equations. Hey, 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 h
4x squared equals 4x plus 8. So I'm going to set it equal to 0 because I noticed there's a squared there. When there's a squared there, I need to treat it as a quadratic. So setting it equal to 0, moved everything over to the other side. Now, I need a factor. But look at that a value. That a value is greater than 1. But what should I always check for when I am factoring a problem? What should I always check for first? A GCF, because the GCF will save me some time, okay? I'm going to go ahead and take out a 4, because the 4 goes into all of those things evenly. And look what's left in the blue. The blue is an A equals 1 problem. So that's the easy, I don't have to do nothing hard here. Okay, x minus 2, x plus 1, solve it by setting it equal to 0. I'm going to get x equals 2 and x equals negative 1. Should I check my answers? I sure should check my answers because guess what I'm going to figure out when I check my answers, okay? That the only valid answer is actually x equals 2, okay? Again, checking out answers, that's your business, not mine. All right. Um, solve the radical equation. N example number five. Change the rational exponent to a radical. A cube root. Thank you, because the one-third exponent is the same thing as a cube root. Undo the radical with an exponent. Three times three times three is 27. Isolate the x. Subtract 5. We're almost done, people. Okay? You should check your answers again. Your business, not my business. Last but not least. Example number 6. Again, you should be pausing the video. Stop. See if you can figure it out by yourself. Then watch me do it. Don't just watch me do it. I know what I'm doing. I have a degree. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this thing is always making me feel like it stopped recording. Whew. Anyway, um, 2x plus 15 to the 1 half power. 1 half power, change it to an exponent. It's a square root. I mean, change it to a radical. Undo the radical with an exponent. Uh -huh. 2x plus 15 equals x squared. Set it equal to 0. Hey, factor. Hey, solve. Oh, my goodness. What should I do now? I should check my answers. I've checked my answers. And look, negative 3 is extraneous, but 5 works, baby. Okay, that's it. Um, if you didn't get them right, rewind the video, take out a fresh sheet of paper, try it again.